Hey guys, I'm going to show you guys how I wrap my hair. Now I just finished flat ironing it and I put some curls at the end with my flat iron so that the wrap will hold better. So all I did was go over with my flat iron the ends and curl them. You can also use bumpers for this, but because I already have my flat irons on, I went on ahead and used those. So, I'm going to show you the curls. which I actually like and it's weird because I don't wear my hair um, when I flat iron it I don't wear it straight a lot I mean I don't wear curls in it but I think I'm going to start but anyway I'm going to brush the hair forward I don't put anything on my hair when I'm wrapping it. You're going to want some clips handy. Then I take my other brush and just smooth the hair. Now, if your hair is silky bone straight after you flat iron it, um, it has a lot, a lot of body. It's a little, it's easier if you curl your hair afterwards and if you use clips. And so I do just take the clip. Clip the back. And continue to some people do it in sections um, that helps too You want to make sure you keep your hand on the top because you don't want the top part to come up there. Oops. And the more clips you use, the better the hold. The main thing is making sure all the hair is smooth. Now I believe I use about five clips. And I know some people don't like wrapping their hair the same way every night, um, but 
that's how I do it. I wrap mine the same way because that's how I wear my hair. I don't switch up my part. So for me, it's necessary to wrap it in one direction. Now, what I put on first is my tight uh, cap, I guess, tight cap. And I do it from the top. Ugh, it's kind of tricky sometimes. So. But the key thing is to be uh, quick about it. Then you want to go around and take the clips out. I would not recommend sleeping with these clips in your hair. For one, it's metal, and I don't know anybody who want to sleep with the metal in their hair. And for two, they will leave, um, they will leave, uh, imprints in your hair. So, after I get them all out, I'll go around, smooth the hair, underneath. Once I make sure it's all in, I twist my cap just to make sure all the hairs on the inside are all um, basically brushing in the same direction. So I'll just twist it just a little bit. That's it. And now I add my scarf. Satin scarf. And this just gives it like extra stability and, and it helps it lay flatter than just having that one um, cap on. And then you want to make sure the ends are tucked in. And there you have it. Now my hair will probably stay like this um, overnight and sometimes for um, most of the next day. But I'm going to show you guys the wrapped results in the morning so you guys stay tuned hey guys so it's the next day and I'm going to take down my wrap and it is like 12 30 and I've already uh, taken my shower um, cleaned up and everything so usually for people with natural hair the problem is their hair starts sweating um, after they've done all that. So if you just leave your wrap up until after all that's done and your hair has calmed down, you will get a lot better results.
Now, what I gotta do is comb your hair. I'm gonna put the front back some. This is the result. Now, if I would have not curled the end so tightly, my hair would pretty much be bone straight, but it still has a curl in it at the end. Well, not really curl, but like it's bumped pretty much, which I like also, so that works too. But, um, and that's what I do every night. So in the mornings, I do not have to put a flat iron or any kind of heat on my hair at all. I literally just take out my wrap, brush it out and style it and I'm done. And see the edges are still straight. And now that I got all the, my work done for the day, I don't have to, um, I won't be running around trying to do anything and you know, sweating in my hair and stuff. And I am not going to put anything in my hair. Um, it is still shiny from when I blow dried it, so, and then after I fight on it, so, I mean, this is it. This is how my hair is going to be and then uh, the more as the days go on you know and my hair starts getting naturally oily um, it's going to be a lot easier to um, a lot easier to wrap it and this bump that it has in it now it will come out so my hair just um, when I take it out in a few days after having wrapped it'll just be straight and it won't have like these little curls in the front and stuff. It'll just be like a normal wrap. But that's it, ladies. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope that was helpful. Uh, again, I do not sleep in the clips. I would not recommend sleeping in the clips or bobby pins or anything. Uh, they will crease your hair. And then if you have a crease in your hair, what are you gonna do when you wake up? You're gonna go to the flat irons and um, try to straighten that part. So. Just leave the clippings to help you, to aid you in um, wrapping it and then just take it out. So, again, if you guys have any questions or comments, just let me know and I'll, you know, get back to you guys as soon as possible. Bye.